Hey guys, and welcome back to Daily Duels. So today is Wednesday, means we're using Hermit Yokai. So hopefully we can get some good duels in, much better than Vitamin Y, I'm hoping. Anyway, oh, this hand is kind of bad, but not too terrible. Of course, we're going to activate this. We're going to set this. We're going to set this. And pass. I'm trying out Mirror Force just because I feel like, you know, the deck goes kind of slow and I don't need my opponent spamming the hell out of me and killing me real quick. So I just throw Mirror Force, but we're just going to go ahead and test it out. Um, so, next turn, not too terrible, I'm gonna go ahead and, of course, get a... Well, now I'm not gonna get a fucking token. <sighs> Damn it. I really needed that token, too. I should change the deck around a little bit. I actually put in, uh, the Monarch card. The uh, Monarch Stormforth. So now I can tribute my punk monsters and summon my level 6s. Helps with the summoning a little 7s a little bit, but overflowing purgatory. That would've been nice to have. What, you opened up with Hornet? Ladybug. Okay. Yep. He gets to go ahead and search for the hornet. Well, this still is gonna suck. This still is gonna suck real bad. I clearly do not have the hand to beat only against Exactus. I really needed that. Alright. Go for Kamatachi. No. Chippy you. Summon you. So during the end phase, this card was special summon. Alright. Yes, I will use my fact. Go ahead. Oh, oh, thank God I got Kamami Tachi. Kamami Tachi. If I didn't draw that, I'd be in a deep shit load of trouble. So, thank you, Kamami Tachi. Wow, Dragonfly too, huh? Mm -mm. Fuck up with your Dragonfly ass. Hell no, you're too good. Hell no. Hey, get the fuck out of my face with that. <laughs> I'll play Divine Win. It's not the best of cards right now, for sure. So, let's see how long I can last. I said all he needs to do is just draw into one Insector. Just to be able to equip that Hornet. That's all he needs. Maybe he's got some Revival card. Yeah, I like to run Revival and Mighty Bell Insector, so maybe he has, like, Call a Hunter or something. Mirror Force. Definitely not the card right now. Oh, he's gonna actually summon Hornet. What does that do? I didn't even know that was a card. Hello? I did not even know that was a card that existed. Alright, well. Time to bring this duel. Wow, that's like one turn late. I wish I would have had that last duel. Last turn. Ugh. Come on, Dak. Please cooperate with me. So him destroying my freaking field spells sucks like ass. Yes. Uh, does it matter? Not really. I plan on attributing it anyway, so it really doesn't matter. I'll summon you. Yes. No. Attribute you, or you again. Keep for another 23. Go ahead. Like I said. Got another U, so if he tries to summon in Zector, of course I can just handle that situation real quick. That's good. So we might be able to actually win this duel. Anyway, uh, I'm supposed to be telling you guys about my Tuesday. My, my Veterans Day. For those of you who are here in America, you know, Veterans Day. wonder if that's Mr. Tomato. Be interesting to see. Nope, target one face up. Alright. Uh You can add one insect type monster with 
Nah, that's fine. Who are you gonna get? Can't get centipedes. Ladybug? Ladybug's the only one I can think of. Dragonflies in the graveyard. Yeah, ladybug. And then you'll come back to me. Ah, my veteran's day was tiring. Super tiring. You think that veteran's day, the day off, you think I'd just be chill, relaxing, get a day off in the middle of the week? Once return you can uh, once return you can equip one insect monster from your hand or graveyard to this card. This card can uh, you can send this Does it have any unequip effect? I don't remember if Ladybug has an unequipped effect. Huh, I don't know. I guess. Like I said, I'm not sure if she does. So if you equip Hornet, can you just unequip Hornet to pop and do nothing, or what? I'm not sure. I'm unsure of this. Okay, Hornet unequips to pop. Oh, okay. I wasn't completely sure of that. Yep, I definitely should have hit that. That was my bad. Oops. Totally my bad. That's what I get for not really knowing Insectors, huh? I misplayed. Oh well, I don't care. Should have totally hit that. I didn't know. I didn't know that uh, it went like that. If I would have hit him with the counter trap, uh, this duel would have been over, but I didn't know. I didn't know that it was going to be like Hornet equipping and popping. I thought you had to equip to get some kind of effect, but that's what I get for being ignorant. <laughs> uh, so I probably lose this duel. Probably lose this duel. I hope I draw into another Hermit Yokai. If I don't, that's most definitely again. Probably gonna take these two XC. Or maybe just leave them like that. If he does XC, I can go summon, summon, go for Lightning Chidori. Bounce that, bounce that, and then attack. So, the only way I can win this duel is if I draw Hermit Yokai. If I don't draw Hermit Yokai Monster, then I'm fucked. That's what I get for being ignorant. I had this duel. He got lucky that I'm I'm bad and I don't know anything about Zectors, because I totally thought I was like, oh you can't equip. You don't you can't equip. And I didn't drop a Hermit Yokai monster. Alright, you got it. You only got it because I misplayed, so technically I had it, but Oh well, let me go ahead and get another duel in. Be right back. Alright, back with another duel. So yeah. My veterans day, I decided to use it. To uh, get a lot of work done. A lot of work. This hand is... <gasps> okay. It's not too terrible. It has place. Like I said, I'm gonna go... Go ahead and take the damage on the chin. And then... You know, tribute his monster with Monarch Storm 4. Or my uh, guy. Hopefully. Oh. Alright. I'm going against Skull Servants. This should be fun. So you're just gonna summon your 3,000 beater guy already? No? Just set a monster? That's it? Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Yes. 
It's like, do you get your effect? Yeah, when this car is sent to the graveyard. Period. Alright, so what do you do if you inflict this card special summon and return it to the hand? Huh. Okay. Well, I prefer to get something that's not gonna return to my hand, so. Uh, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna summon Kamami Tachi. Kamami Tachi. So she can get that direct damage in, and then I can get my search on. Kamami Tachi, search, or... Kamatachi, so I can go summon you, summon you, next turn, and then spin something. Alright, I'm done. So you return back to my hand, alright? Yep, that's fine. Uh, anyway, Veterans Day, I worked on my education. I love, uh, but not my education, but my education work that I had to do for my education class course, trying to become a teacher. So, uh... <laughs> Unbeknownst to me, there is a ton of assignments. It, there was a ton of assignments that I, uh, that I was required to do. So, uh, teacher, definitely not the uh, best teacher when it comes to, uh, you know, really deciding on what assignments uh, should be turned in and when they should be turned in. Definitely not. Alright, I wonder if that's another uh, right prince. Hmm. Not completely sure about that. Uh. What do you do? I can go directly. Okay. That's fine, alright. You. No. Yes. No. Summon you. No. Yes. No. Summon you. No. No. <laughs> Alright. You go ahead and attack. Alright, I thought it was going to be Lady. I thought it was. Sure, I'll make a direct attack. Can I activate you? Uh... Yeah, give me you. Of course, you're not going to be doing anything, so... And I'll just activate... Your effect, put you back in the hand. No. Is there anything that I want to do this turn? <laughs> uh... No, not really. I'm just going to in. Everybody come back to me. No. Come back. Come back. Come back. So, the first assignment that I had to do, that was supposed to be super late because the teacher's terrible with, you know, keeping track of what assignments uh, need to be turned in, what assignments don't need to be turned in, etc, etc. So, uh, apparently we're supposed to do a one, well, a self-portrait, pretty much. You're supposed to imagine yourself as a teacher in five years and, you know, what teaching techniques and what you learn and why you want to be a teacher, etc, etc, essay. So, I had to get that done and uh, it's okay. I kind of BS'd it, but still, I got it done. It was like three pages long, I want to say. Well, not three, more like two, a little bit more than two pages. Like three printed pages, but yeah. Now just call Servant, Curry Bandit, and Mizuki. Gonna use Mizuki and summon Bitch prince, Princess again. Saving the solemn morning. Definitely saving this all morning. You hit me for 19? Sure. More power to you. Alright, so. What's the order that I want to do this? Hmm. Who's the one that's not that good? You're not that good. Right? Zombie, alright. So, I'm gonna summon. Uh, Kamami Tachi. Needlebug's nice. No, that's fine. Uh, Kamami Tachi summon, uh, 
Yeah. You. No. Yes. You. You. No. Yes. No. Come on, you. There we go. Now I actually have a Hermit Yoka on the field. Alright, so. I'm definitely going to be killing you two, that's a given. Really not in the mood to spin anything back at the current moment, so. Watch that, you kill you. Well, don't you just kill the monster automatically? Sure, whatever. Doesn't really matter. Alright, we're gonna have you kill you. Yes. Go ahead and get me the trap card. And I have a feeling that next turn. Please tell me I have cowboy. Can I go for cowboy? Going for cowboy end it? I didn't do the math. Yes, it would. Do I have cowboy. Daniel, you love cowboy. You have cowboy. Yes, you do. I love you, Daniel. I love that you love cowboy. It's cowboy wins games. I don't care what people say. Oh, I don't like cowboy. Like, no, cowboy wins games. Cowboy wins games. Stop asking me if I want to sell more in my own fucking car. Bam. Woo! Did it. Actually, won a duel. <laughs> All right, let's get another duel. In. One more duel. All right, be right back. All right, last duel. Last duel. So, uh, yeah, I got that assignment done. I'm trying out this right now. I want to go ahead and see how useful this card is. Uh, right now, I'm pretty chill. I don't know. No, I'm taking slow. I want a Monarch Storm before I throw your monsters. Oh, you have no extra deck, so either you're bad or you're using something sacky. Something sacky. Zodia. I don't really like this card, but we'll go ahead and try it. Really? Like, really? I really wanted to duel. Like, that's why I came. Stop using Zoya. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna get another duel in. Be right back. Someday some people will learn. Be right back. Uh, you know, I host. I clearly want to duel because of hosting. This guy, what's, in here? What's, what's going through his mind? He wants to go against Exodia. Like, no, I don't want to go against Exodia. Hello? Oh, Harpies. They're gonna have a wind off, I guess. Let me guess. You got the sign in your hand? No, you're just gonna pitch the hunting round. Okay. Channel their pitch. Some dragon. Make a Draco suck. Draco suck. That's fine. Draco suck. Like I said, I'm not really a big fan of this card, but we're gonna go ahead and try it. No, first turn Draco Sack's not as strong as it used to be, now since uh, Castell exists. Even defense mode still like, yeah, but, you know, I still have this. <laughs> Alright, activate Shrine. No. Summon Har Harmon Yokai. Chop a counter on that bitch. I have to wait in the fusion. Pay my thousand. Summon my wind monster. You better help that face down and something stop me. I need Chidori. You better hope that that face down is like a song in the morning or something. Run that. Spend that. I'll leave you with tokens. You got tokens? I need Chidori to just wreck your whole entire field in existence. Like, hello? Uh, anyway, uh, another assignment that had to be done is, of course, oh, alright, get Hunter Ground. So far, you're not really re revealing anything that threatening, but okay, that's fine. 
You got a harpy in your hand? Is that a harpy? Or are you burning out of resources? Like I said, the first turn Draco sack is not as good as it used to be, especially with the existence of Castell. Oh, you just want to pop my back, bro. Nah, that's fine. So then you're gonna go back to the hand and then summon yourself again. But you're not doing anything! Eh, I might as well compulse one of your tokens. Just remove it from the field. So you have one less token. Nice. You're just not doing anything, though. Alright. Dory. So what do you do? Let's try to target target one face up card by point control to the top and back. And slow this door down by one turn. Just to make sure that you draw nothing. Go ahead. Draw. Draw. <gasps> what did you draw? <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> wow, alright. Lots of Monarch Storm Forests. I you know, wish I had some tribute monsters. It's all I need is to tribute, and I'll be cool. I need my Hermit Yokais, please. Like, you know, Hermit Yokais. So I'm running this, then I'm not getting any Hermit Yokai monsters to even use the shrine with. Like, hello? Yep. Someone come on and touch me. I guess it kind of helps my consistency. I gotta get three counters. But it helps, I guess. Alright. Story. Stop. I'm just Mirror Force. I don't give a shit. If it's Deep Prison, I wouldn't mind that either. You can go ahead and Deep Prison this Lightning Story. I don't need it anymore. I don't need it. I don't need it. Definitely don't need it. Alright, so you can return to my hand, and I'll summon you again next turn, and then I get my third counter, and then I'll finally get to be able to search for a level 6. Ugh. Anyway, uh, another summon I had to do was Field Observation. Well, of course, I had to do Field Observation. That's a given. Oh, he actually drew a Harpy Lady. It wouldn't be, there's no point in playing the Harpy's Hunting Ground unless you drew the Harpy Lady. Oh, thanks for the boost and attack. <laughs> All wind monsters game. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I'm a tribute monster. Alright. Yes. <laughs> would you like to use your opponent's monster? Oh, yes, I would. <laughs> That's what I thought. Alright. Uh, Harpy. Like I said, their first turn Draco sat, like, you didn't, you didn't have any background to back it up, therefore it wasn't that scary. You know, even Castell. Anybody can make a Castell and spin back a Draco sack, so, yeah. Anyway, the other assignment, well, a field observation, we have to do, pretty much with our field observation, we have to do two assignments. So the first one, the first assignment was really, really dumb. Like, literally, it was like, learn about the school, uh, learn the school's map. Ask about the teacher's handbook and learn about fire drills and boring shit like that. I'm like, hello? You know, I'm just gonna write an essay about my experience. Not in the classroom, but the school experience. And I'm just gonna turn in shit. You know, if I get a bad grade on it, it doesn't matter. Because that grade curve is so easy. Like, as long as I turn it on my assignment, I'm, I'm allowed to get credit for my extra credit. Everything is based on a four-point scale. And the extra credits, there's 32 of them, and they're each worth one point. So literally, I could turn this essay in, he'd be like, you know what, you didn't follow the instructions. You can't give me a zero, because I actually committed to the assignment. You can give me one point. Alright, one. That's fine. I'm going to turn in three extra credit assignments. Now it's a three. So I may have done shit on the assignment, because due to your extra credit, I get a perfect score. Like, that's the curve in his fucking class. Stupid. So I did that. Um, the other assignment that you have to do is you have to do a movie review. So uh, he has a list of edu... Uh, movies based on education and you pretty much have to watch a movie and write like an essay about it so when he when he said this and i had to watch a movie he had the list i was like please 
please let Stand and Deliver be on that list because that is like my favorite movie. I love Stand and Deliver. So I was like, please let Stand and Deliver be on there. And then, hold and behold, the second movie, Stand and Deliver. I'm like, yes! I not only have I seen that movie, but I'm going to write this essay and I, you know, I, I'm going to watch it again because, you know, I haven't watched it in a couple of years. I watched it in calculus class in a year and then, he, you know, he teaches his, in the movie, spoiler alert, he, he teaches his kids AP calculus and they take that AP test and I've learned, and then we watched that movie in my AP calculus class and then we took the test, you know? So, yeah, and he's a math teacher and I want to be a math teacher, so, uh, like I said, that movie is awesome. I love that movie. It's probably, it's probably, it's probably my favorite movie. Okay, one of my favorite movies. Love that movie. Anyway, um, so I write that, wrote that, and it's like two pages. It, it really wasn't a review or summary, but just kind of answering questions about how he is as a teacher and stuff like that. How is it going to relate to you as a teacher? I don't know. I'm just going to BS and get this assignment over here. Like, all right, so that's another assignment done. All right, but you guys are probably wondering, Daniel, did you get? that assignment done. Daniel, did you finish your fucking project? Cause you guys have known these last couple of daily duels. I fuck bro, I have an episode named Fuck Project, so come on. Yes, I did. I actually got my project done. So I worked on my PowerPoint. It's only a couple of slides, but just long enough just to beat meet the presentation's requirement. I decorated them with art. Like really, really lazy print, print. Like literally I just took images off the internet, put it on the pushed it to the back, pulled the text out to the front, and then just decorated it. Like, this is what I did. My PowerPoint's really lazy, but I don't care. Uh, so, tomorrow being, uh, well, not tomorrow, today, because <laughs> this video goes up on Wednesday, I gotta get up in a monkey suit, so gotta wear my suit and tie, looking all uh, shining, glistening, all dipped in butter, and get up there and present. I'm just gonna get it over with, and then, yeah. And then I won't have to worry about it anymore. I just get it over with, really. So, uh, yeah. I got everything that I wanted to get done on my uh, my day off with Veterans Day. So I'm glad I got this day off, got to get a lot of things done. So for my education class, there's not much left. Like, um, literally, I think the only thing I have to do left is write, like, one more paper. I think one more paper, and then my second assignment for my fail finish. And literally, that's pretty much it. Like, that's pretty much the end of the class besides your final. So I'm almost done. That's good. I'm just gonna pass that education class and move on. <laughs> My other education class next semester is online, so yay. So at least I won't have to worry about presenting in front of the class because it's online. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and call it an episode. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duels. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And uh, how do I feel about this guy? You know, I guess I'll keep it in. Just because this deck is really inconsistent sometimes, so it's nice to just go summon one of my Hermio Kaiser returns to the hand, summon one of my Hermio Kaiser returns to the hand, and then keep doing that and keep getting counters and keep searching. So I guess we'll keep in your kind trying to trials. Besides that, the rest of the deck is okay right now. A little inconsistent, but hey, what you gonna do? I'm trying my best. I'm running the, be the deck as best as I can. All right. So I hope that you guys enjoyed. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow with Burning Abyss. Yep, Burning Abyss. Alright, thanks for watching.